हेलो एवरीवन आप देख रहे हैं रोहिणी इंग्लिश क्लासेस फ्रेंड्स आज की वीडियो में आप सीखेंगे इंग्लिश स्टोरी के जरिए इंग्लिश कैसे सीखें आज की स्टोरी है हमारी द लिटिल मैच गर्ल स्टोरी इट वाज न्यू ईयर ईव इट वाज कोल्ड इट वाज स्नोइंग द गर्ल सेलिंग मैचेस वाज वॉकिंग इन द cold and snowing street and loudly said matches i have matches please buy them but no one paid attention to her everyone was rushing past him and leaving a woman was found from a distance the girl ran to her and begged ma'am please buy me a matches i don't need it girl at home I have a lot of matches. It is snowing faster. The girl was shivering from the cold. Wow, how cold it is! I have to go home, but no, I can't go back until I sell the matches because my father will beat me again. The girl stopped. She put her frozen hands in front of her mouth and ha. to them and then she started again matches i have matches please buy them but no one come to her no one brought a matches from her the little match girl selling matches the girl was hungry she had not eaten anything since morning her heart was weak from hunger a house smelled of good food wow what a good smell how hungry i am i have to sell the matches and go home soon if i don't hurry people will go home she made his step faster and her voice louder i have matches i have matches a matches the girl was about to across the middle of the street when suddenly she heard a voice tap 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 it was the sound of a horse pulling a cart that was spending towards him the girl was shocked he quickly pulled herself out of the way of the horse and cart but her wooden boots fell off her feet and he was thrown into the snow little match girl falling down wow my wooden shoes a memory a memory of my dear mother what do i do now where did they fall how do i find them the little girl brushed away the snow with her cold and frozen hands and looked for her wooden shoes once her eyes fall on the other side of the street one of her shoes had fallen there among the snow there it is carried the little girl happily and ran to the other side of the streets but as soon as she wanted to take the shoe a a mischievous and evil child come snatched the shoes from her hand and mischievously said wow what a good thing i found when i grow up i will make it my baby's cradle then he ran away the girl was walking with bare feet in the cold and snowy street it was snowing heavily the girl hair was white from the snow there was no one left on the street everyone had gone to their homes light shine from the windows of the house the laughter of child who were happily waiting to eat their mother's cooking could be heard the girl who sold matches signed said and said they are happy i also loved my mother's cooking how happy i was when she was alive her legs were numb from the cold she wanted to go home but she still hadn't sold a single matches she could no longer take a step she sat 
under the porch of a house she tired to warm her hands and feet with her breath but it was useless it was not warm the girl said to herself i am cold i did better light a match maybe i will warm up a bit then he pulled one of the match stick to the wall the match was light and in the middle of its flame a warm and bright heater appeared the girl said happily how good now i can warm myself with this heater but as soon as she wanted to approach the stove and warm himself the stove turned off only a burnt matches stick remained in her hand the girl took another match stick and put it on the wall the match was light this time the girl saw a dish full of food in the middle of the match flame wow what a delicious food little red girl and the flat of food in the food dish there were pumps apples and a fried goose from which fragrant steam rose the little girl was looking at the food dish with joy and surprise suddenly in front of her eyes a fried goose flew with a knife and fork stuck in her back the little girl reached out to the catch the goose but the flame of the match ran out and the imaginary foods disappeared there was no sign of food in front of the girl's eyes there was only a long and cold wall she also light the third match the fire burned and the christmas tree appeared with several lighted candles the girl's eyes sparkled with joy what a tree it is even more beautiful than the christmas tree of the rich people the girl stretched her hand towards the tree but at the same time the match went out the christmas tree also disappeared only the flame of one of the candles remained which quickly rose and soon it became a star and cloud clung to the chest of the sky it was as if they had painted a christmas tree in the sky the little girl was looking at the sky in wonder how beautiful it is and suddenly she showed that so that a star separated from the sky and fall down she said to herself so tonight someone will die little match girl and the falling star she learned this from her grandmother grandmother used to say when she was alive if a star falls to the ground it means that someone will die and his soul will go to god the little girl remembered her kind grandmother and said softly grandmother i miss you so much she also liked the fourth match at that time in the middle of the fire she show his kind grandmother ah my grandmother and jumped into her arms grandmother hugged and kissed her kindly the little girl explained her hardship and problems to her grandmother then she said crying my good grandmother don't go away from me I know when the match goes out you will disappear like a hot stove and a roast goes and a christmas tree want you at the same time the flame of the match went out 
The grandmother's face also went dark. The little girl shouted, No, grandmother, don't go. I don't want to go. I want to stay with me. I want you stay with me. Then she took out all the matches from the box and said to herself, I will set them all on fire. Maybe I can keep the grandmother. The girl pulled the matches stick to the wall. The fire flared, flared up and lighted up the surroundings. In the light of the fire, the grandmother's face was found again. My grandmother, my dear grandmother, don't leave me alone, cried the little girl. Grandmother smiled, then he gently hugged the girl. In the black night sky, a bright and luminous path opened. In the bright way, the little girl and her grandmother went lighter and higher. Higher and higher. Grandmother, where are where are we going? We are going to heaven, baby. Paradise. What kind of place is heaven? Heaven is a warm place full of flowers. It is full of delicious food. New. Your mother is there too. She is waiting for you now. From now on. The three of us live happily together. Your difficulties and problems are over, my dear. The little girl heart was filled with joy. He, she felt very happy. Then she surely closed his eyes. In this way, the girl flew to God. She became a star in the night sky. The night ended, the sun rose. The night ended, the sun rose. The bells rang and announced the approaching deliver of the year. People who came to the street saw the girl laying on the ground with her eyes closed. They ran and informed the doctor but the girl's body was cold. He felt this world hours ago. Her lips were like red apples. It had a beautiful smile on it. It was like falling into a blissful sleep. It was full of burnt matches sticks. A bunch of burnt matches could be seen in her hand. Someone said, Oh God, this kid wanted to warm himself with a matches fire. Tears rolled in people's eyes. In the meantime, a woman's voice was heard crying. She was the same woman whom the little girl had asked to buy a matches the night before the woman voice could be heard in the middle of her crying forgive me i'm sorry my poor girl if i had brought a match from you last night maybe this wouldn't have wouldn't have happened a few people signed and fixed their sad eyes on the ground they were the ones who had seen the girl the night before and had not brought a match from her. People lifted the cold body of the girl and took it to the church. Everyone prayed, prayed for the peace of her soul, but no one knew what beautiful thing the little girl had seen in the flame of the matches and with what great joy she had flown to the sky to the sky now he was in heaven with her mother and grandmother they had celebrated the new year in the heaven maybe if people listened well they would hear the girl laughter and happiness from heaven आई होप फ्रेंड्स आपको स्टोरी पसंद आई होगी स्टोरी कैसी लगी मुझे कमेंट बॉक्स में लिखकर जरूर बताना और ऐसी इंटरेस्टेड वीडियो के लिए 
चैनल को लाइक शेयर सब्सक्राइब करना ना भूलें साथ में बेल आइकन को भी प्रेस करें जिससे कि आने वाली वीडियो की नोटिफिकेशन सबसे पहले आपके पास पहुंचे थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग